Okay, so we're gonna play some Banjo Tui. I almost said Banjo Kazooie 2, but that's wrong. You're not allowed to say that. So let's play this. This is my first time playing this as usual. Let's see if this classic is as good as people say it is. <laughs> you haven't joined for like a month. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Where is it? Here we go. Oh, oh shit, it's going! Is the music glitched? Music sounds weird. Oh, oh, oh no, it's picking up! <laughs> you just woke up, you're in the dark, you're not ready for jump scares. Boo. We're playing the bear and the birds, indeed. Also, yes, we got some new emotes, I finally made some. Let me show them, show them here before I start. I made my first animated emote. No! And then we got the, got the clown. This is a follower emote, so you can use it even if you just follow the clown one. And we got the lurk. Lurking. Clown. <laughs> okay, this game is loud. Let me like get the volume good. Okay, what the fuck? I don't want spoilers. I don't want game spoilers. Stop! Stop spoiling me! Press start. I'm pressing start. My controller isn't working. Uh, hang on. Options. Controller. Here we go. You can play as Moomba! What the fuck? Okay, hang on. Here we go. There we go. I'm not using a keyboard. Not this time. Uh, yeah, press A to play the game. Multiplayer. Wow. Uh, this feature is not yet available. Please try again later. Okay. Let's go take a look at the settings. You honestly thought only subscriber could, could use them? There's two different emotes. There's subscriber emotes and follower emotes. Subscriber emotes are only available to subscribers and follower emotes. Everyone who follows can use. <laughs> the fucking clown with the hat. <laughs> you want the dapper, right, clown? Uh, screen alignment. Uh, wide screen mode, off, speaker mode, stereo. Okay, I think we are good. <laughs> Gregory, you must play the Xbox 360 version of Banjo Dooie. It is the most stable version, Gregory. Gregory. Nah, I'm playing the original. And I'm gonna enjoy it. You made him cringe more. Ah, oh, the flat. The toast got flatted. Rayman, Rayman 2 intro. Two years have passed since Grundil that the witch was defeated by Banjo and Kazooie. Yo, thanks for the sub. After fall falling from her tower, she was buried underground, where she remains until this very day. Can't believe Grant is real. <laughs> no good, mistress. Still can't shit rock. <laughs> All because of that stupid bear. 
<laughs> Gathered friends, listen once more to the tale of the Banjoricals. Bamba play well, as much of bears cash. Mm, he's right, Kazooie. There goes your bird seed, buddy. Can't believe they're playing poker. Don't be so rude, Banjo! Hey, look outside! Everyone! Granted the witch is coming! <laughs> where? Where, Kazooie? I can't see her. Oh, uh, false alarm, Bruce! Must have been some shadows! Come on, Boneface! Let's play! I feel lucky! I can't believe they're playing, playing poker. You remember this one being pretty laggy, so be careful. I'm gonna catch up on chat after the cutscene, hang on. <laughs> the nose. Oh, stop rocking the table. You're ma ma making me sick. M -m 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 rocking table. Whole house shakes lots. Perhaps one of us should go take a look outside. Who's gonna be the epic fart man inside the machine? Kryptonite? <laughs> what the fuck is this? I've never seen this character before. Uh, hurry, Blabelle, uh, our sister is waiting. This is amazing, there's more witches! Quickly, we must go or angry Grundy will be! Then get her off of me, you must, or boo I cannot! Amazing. The <laughs> green pearl. <laughs> it stopped now, I wonder what it was. Sure was noisy, let's go take a look! Kazooie? But, but it's dark out there, and uh, I, I'll be scared! Bubba Butch Brave, me go look outside. Back in a minute. You are a sucker, huh? Come on, Banjo, give me a hand! Kazooie! <laughs> It's cool that there's an intro, but it is pretty long, yeah. Don't mind it so far, though. Sorry, mistress, I have failed you. Worry, Grandy mustn't Get you out, your sister's will. Big Rock is so powers we must combine. Grandy sisters, you should not mock. Now watch our magic blast this rock! Oh, rock has been blasted! Go on, rock's house! So out you can come! Look at that cat! Oh my god, dry... Uh, dry Grandilda. How long was she down there? 
No, 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 this cannot be. What's happened to little old me? Nice grand looks. Lost weight you have. I hate bones. A body I need. Can you help with this little deed? <laughs> Yes, brand help we have. So back to our castle we must go. Right then, girls, let's fix me up. Then Banjo's hairy butt and whop! <laughs> Fuck! This is not good. Go tell. Uh, see that's body man has. Him we must whack. Leave it to me, he's no hassle. I'll kick butt, then off to the castle. Oh my gosh, she's coming. Oh, uh, Raymond 2 sound effect. Oh, wait, wait, redemption sound effect. Mr. Dark's lightning attack. <laughs> Here's the lag you guys were warning me about. Oh. Guess I'll be. <clears throat> Guess I'll be having that business. Blah, 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 blah. But you cheater, Kazooie, that's not... Everyone! <gasps> Must run! <gasps> Quick! Grunty coming! <laughs> Rest in peace, the rock. Revenge is mine! I cannot miss! Let's see that furry fool dodge this shit! Yeah, yeah, Skullboy, and I bet he, she had two heads! No joke! Look! <laughs> Spell coming! Uh, he's right! Quick, everyone out! I'm not falling for that shit. I'm staying right here. Bottles died. This intro is long, hang on guys. Hurry, you must! Ready to leave me, we are! Hold on, sis, I'm nearly there! I've just been to blast that bear! Troops, we will leave! Destroy area, they will! She doesn't rhyme or then I'm just stupid. Are we playing Kingdom Hearts or, uh, Bonjo? Stop, wait for me, mistress! Grunty! No, no, Klango! You stay here! I'll be back! Have no fear! Oh, poor Klungo. Bungie shit dead. Oh no. <laughs> oh, Bobo's head hurts. Look at our house! Well, at least everyone got out safely. Hang on, where's Goggle Boy? Oh, he didn't die. <laughs> uh oh, Bo looks much unwell. It's worse than that. <laughs> Grunt is killed. Poor bottles. He wasn't the favorite character in. Banjo Kazooie, anyway! Kazooie! I'm sorry! Grunty break house and kill bottles! She must pay! Bear and bird get after witch! Bumble see you later! Great, I get to pack some more witch butt! 
Let's go, Banjo. Uh, I have a feeling it's not going to be so easy this time. Oh my god. <laughs> Withered bottles. <laughs> I can't believe he died. Like, really died. That If that was... Like, if this game came out today, it would be at least PG-12. Look at my best clothes. They're all burnt. Alright, let's have a little look. Do I remember how to play Banjo-Kazooie? <laughs> you like how casually they mention balls died. Yeah, nowadays you can't even say kill in a game. <laughs> Everything is shitted. This game is a wee bit darker than the first one. Just like Rayman 2! Dude. Real. Funny they assume Bottles would become an angel. He had some dark secrets. Look at my best. Okay, do I? Let's, uh... Okay, so that's that. That's that attack. Do I have my full arsenal from the first game? Looks like I do. Help! I was knocked off the barbecue! And then the blunder to Shredder to weigh the boulder. Please get rid of it. I can hardly breathe. Okay, how do I do the belly smash? No? Okay. Unrelated to Punch and 2 but does unlocking a random sub emote keep it unlocked for future streams? No, it's only for 24 hours, because it's uh, channel redemption points. Mm, stupid bear and bird coming! We will put them in here! I like Klungo. <laughs> Don't talk smack about Rayman 2. That game played the biggest part in your childhood. Rayman 2 fucking sucks! No. This dude is tiny as fuck. There we go. Whoa, new models for the health pickups. Pick up Holly to boost your energy! Who the fuck are you? Gold feathers are used for invulnerability! <laughs> you can't believe I would lie about Raven to live on stream. Why the fuck does Bonjo sound like that? He sounds like his muscles are about to burst and there's gonna be testosterone everywhere. <laughs> What did they do to borrow Banjo? <laughs> you wonder if I played these games before? I did not play this one. I played the first one last year, but not the sequel, not this one, not yet. Knock the boulder? Okay. Oh, uh, you don't like... Oh, you do like the game reuses the... Up the world makes it feel a true continuation to Kazooie. Yeah, I like this too. It's like the same area but like different. How did I do the funny attack again? How did I do the thing? Um. It's a shame you can't explore the full destroyed hub. Well, I think this is enough. We don't need to go back to Grundy's castle. You know this? They changed Sponge's voice clips to be less similar to Mario. <laughs> I remember the devs talking about that. Interesting. I can see that. Yeah, I can understand that. Maybe his voice got deeper during the two years since his first game's events. Did he just like smoke and drink? Is that not a power-up? Uh, I don't even remember anymore. 
Z and C left. Oh yeah, C is a thing. Yeah, <laughs> Grandi hole. Biggest gamer hole you're ever. Oh yeah, shitting. Ah, here we go. No. Ah, there we go. There's the run. All right. Alright, alright. <laughs> okay, okay, no. No effect. Ah, uh, here's the boots. Good old booties. There we go. Gregory, do you know of the Grunty Hole? We must go inside, Gregory. Red feathers are needed for Kazooie to fly! <laughs> it's still hilarious that Kazooie shits eggs. Yeah, I like it. You can't believe Smash was so popular they made Punch of his own game. <laughs> you can say the same thing about F-Zero. Ah, uh, here we go. Let's see if I can go in, in the hole, the mouth. Oh, I can! Grandilda's lair. Oh shit, look at this. Ah, oh, the place is fucked. Yo, it's Cheeto. Hello again, Banjo. Remember me? I'm Cheeto, the magical spell book. Yeah, yeah, we know who you are. Just hand over something useful. Uh, you're out of luck. There, I'm afraid. Grundy ripped out all my pages because I helped you in the last game. I'd be most grateful if you could look out for them on your travels. Maybe, what's in it for us? Well, for every five pages you return, I'll let you in on a little secret. You mean a cheat? Well, I'm not called Cheeto for nothing. Nice. You enjoy when family-friendly games take a darker turn. Yeah, same! Jack, Jack 2. Awesome. Rayman 2. Awesome. This game, apparently it's gonna be a bit tar darker, so that's just awesome. Whoosh. You're gonna roll into the mole hints, uh, mole, moles for, mole holes for, hang on. Combo! They did not change all the voice clips though, just some of the grunts. <laughs> yeah, there's, uh -huh. For every five pages, I will give you a random game genie code. <laughs> what did we learn from Cheeto? Grandi is great at multitasking. Yeah, like when did she, when did she have the time to rip, uh, rip the pages? No. <laughs> There's poog starting his <laughs> poog. This book starting his sentences with well, what the fuck he's a redditor? <laughs> redditor. <laughs> Dark chocolate is chocolate too. Holy fuck. <laughs> Every sequel to dead platformers must be dark. Yes. I like my edge. Donkey Kong. 
did Donkey Kong have a dark sequel? Maybe she ripped out the pages sometimes before the final boss. Ah, true. Let's see if I remember how swimming works. Kazooie door. <laughs> Don't use the engage Ridley motherfucker code. What the fuck? Alright, I don't think there's anything to do here. There were no collectibles or anything, so let's just go. Oh no, did it crash? Let's hope it's just loading, because I didn't save. It did crash? Oh. Can you skip the intro? Can you skip the intro? Call him a bunch of bandicoot because this bitch be crashing. <laughs> oh. Please, please auto save. Please, please, please. Okay, okay, the save is still here. Whew. It'll probably throw us into there. Yeah, okay, thank god. Yeah, I will save. I will save, don't worry. <laughs> that was scary for a moment. <laughs> Let me just grab some of these collectibles so I'm fully, fully, fully decked out. For the adventure. Don't tell me it's one of those games that require tweaking or patching. If it is! Well, this is gonna be an interesting stream. You heard that 2 is very sus susceptible to crashing on emulators. Okay, so I just gotta save a lot. That's the solution. And before every loading screen, just save. What am I? Yeah, Project 64. Uh, my, my totally legit Nintendo 64 has a sticker that says Project 64 on it. <laughs> I like interesting strings. I gotta go talk to Cheeto again. That's fine. Actually, maybe I don't. Maybe I don't need to. Though I won't. Help. <laughs> oh, there's a jump pad here. Oh. oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I was so worried. You found one of my missing pages. Collect five, then return them to me in and grab this old lair in Spiral Mountain. <laughs> I also modded the time traveling juice from his PS1 into the Total Legend <laughs> to 64. Yes. Okay, let me actually take a look at the hotkeys for saving. F5. Okay, that's that. What's your favorite Disney animated film? I don't remember enough Disney animated films to decide. I, I always mix up Disney and Pixar, so I don't know which one is which. Oh, Aladdin is really good. Is Incredibles Disney? Because if Incredibles is Disney... Treasure Planet! Yes! Treasure Planet is the best one. How could I forget? Yeah, treasure, treasure Planet, hands down, best one. 
That that g almost said that the game. That movie has an actual like story. <laughs> it's amazing. Let's go into this hole. Oh fuck, Atlantis is like your second? Dude, what the fuck? I also like Atlantis. I don't I don't know if I could say it's my second favorite, but it's at least in top five or top three. I'm here, hello! <gasps> Guys, Ninja to 64 cartridge. Emperor's new groove is a banger? Yes, it is. Disney movies during the late 90s and early 2000s had something going on during their experimental phase. Yeah, I like the stories. Nowadays, Disney movies are just like... <laughs> like, I can't say that because I don't even watch them, but you know. Looked away for its crimes! Okay, let's try this again. Does... It crash. Cross your fingers. Ooh. Yeah, I'm I'm ready to ask for help because people said this game can be a bit crusty. You, you take that back, Encanto is amazing. I haven't watched it. Minion with a mission. Oh, ho, ho, if it isn't the bear and bird who caused so much trouble to mistrust Grunty. Mm, I don't recall anything like that happening. You <laughs> stupid. At least we can speak properly. Clongo <laughs> uh, is mad now. Your game and seer. Yes, actual boss fights. This is what I wanted. First game didn't have bosses, so hopefully this one has. Is invisible? <laughs> Not find clever Klungo now. Okay. <laughs> Banned for bad movie opinions. Come on. He's throwing piss at me. He's also Donkey Kong when he takes damage. Up! There we go. I thought he died. Nasty bear and bird hurts poor Klungo. You asked for it. Why don't you run off and we'll forget this ever happened? Oh, good idea. But you don't see last of Klungo. <sighs> Sorry, that was a fucking yawn. Klungo coming, mistress. Please beat failure Klungo with broomstick. <laughs> He wants to be beaten. <laughs> Engato is like Bonja Tui. <laughs> Klungo likes it rough. Klungo likes the stick. Let's go. <laughs> you had no idea Klungo was into that stuff. They don't call him Kingy Klungo for nothing. What the fuck is this? All of hags. Hags? Like, you know, like old hag. You old hag? 
Have I played the GBA one? No, I haven't. Not sure if I will. They look crusty. <laughs> oh, I like this music. This is an information sign post, soldier. Press B when next to one read it. In loving memory of the great Jinjo family, passed away unexpectedly when a huge digging machine flattened their house. Holy fuck, a whole family died! <laughs> Amazing. Can I go inside these houses? Jinjo! They're all gone! Come and see in my troll room and I'll tell you what happened. Oh! This is my pass! Not bad, eh? Just come on in and see the ginster! The ginster? That looks like it's made out of cookie. Okay, so nothing in the house, just emptiness. <laughs> this is just Smash Bros, turn it off. Ooh. Okay, orange family house. I guess you like fill this with Jinjos later. You love the Jinjo village team. Nice voice, Gark. Jinjo! Yeah, this one is uh, really nice. This is one of my silos! Open up some more to create a network of shortcuts tunnels! Who the fuck are you? Can we get like a. Like an introduction? Not yet, soldier! You'll need to open another silo before you can use the shortcut. Cool, shortcuts. That's what the first game needed. Badly. Soldier. No, it's like a sheriff. Nice. Okay, hags. Oh, you can zoom out. That's good. Okay, so it looks like there's just ginger houses. I'm not gonna go in them. Bottles' house. Okay, interesting. Let me go in the mansion or whatever, castle. I forgot paper. I can't blow my nose. Oh my god, thick. King yo. Yo, what's up? I'm King Jingaling, king of all things Jinjo and ruler of this village. Your kingdom seems a bit empty. My people were scared away by those witches. And their giant machine. We kinda like it quiet. But I need to get them all back for the kickball tournament next week. Doesn't seem that important to me. But it is. There's a big kickball rivalry between the gingos and the moles. Which means there could be trouble if we don't turn up. Oh dear. Exactly. Anyway, here's an Incending for you to rescue my people. <laughs> oh. I believe you should go and see my master J Jiggy Swiggy in his temple now. Jiggy who? Jiggy Wiggy. He's the leader of a secret and ancient order dedicated to the mystical powers of the Crystal Jiggy. Ancient order, Crystal Jiggy, you just made that up, didn't ya? No, honest, it's all true. It's very important to your adventure, as only the Crystal Jiggy can open the worlds that you must earn. <laughs> It'll be my pleasure. Thank you, Jiggy Wiggy. 
Okay, so we need to go through Bottles' house. <laughs> These loading screens scare me. Not bad for a king, huh? Yeah, his strange pet thingy was cool. Let's go and find that Jiminy Wiggity, whatever. Please. Meanwhile, on the prison ship, the Buccaneer, slaves now on board, 1 million and 69. The Death Star? This gave us too much dialogue? You guys are insane. It's good dialogue. It's it's it doesn't matter if there's a lot when it's you know fun and good dialogue. Come on, sisters! Time my lag! What's the plan? To get my body back! Hello in your rhyming is So stop it, or we will not tell! Ah, if I must. She's gonna stop rhyming? B.O.B. this is. Big old blaster built by Mingy and me. Life force from ground, plants and creatures it can suck. Stored in big tank life forces. Sure ground will take when tank full. Then new body you will have. An evil and heartless plan! I like it! How long will it take to suck up enough life force to fuck it? <laughs> Not slim you are, so plenty will be needed. Oh, so start blasting, or I'll start becoming nast nasty. Patient you must be, target you first must pick. Hmm, that cursed jingling has just given the furry fool a jiggy. I reckon we should blast the ginger king's piggy. Who the targeting Bob has? But of you only have to press. Suck! Oh, she pressed the suck. The sucker! Holy oh, shit, guys! The suck and blow! The holy Yuri returns! I can't believe it. Found up Bob is to begin with the firing sequence. The big suck. Well, <laughs> good Bob has hit. Still alive for he will. Unlucky Bob was there we just missed. Never mind him! What about that traitor jingling? <laughs> zombie! He became a zombie! <laughs> He's just a zombie now! Pretty funny and a bobby bow. Successful Bob was Jingling's life force we have. Right then, girls, let's blast the whole island. Or I'll become a big bipedal. This we can do, but big charge of Bob will need. Hours it will take, and revenge Pearl will seek. Ah, I wouldn't worry. Bob just got no one to help him in his story. <laughs> you never get to us in time. He's too fat to climb. They just straight up killed that guy. The body count in this game is already like fucking massive. Oops. No. Here we go. Oof. Let's go uh, C. 
see the king again after that. Pot kettle, black grunty. What? <laughs> Zombified throne room. Does it damage me? Yeah, I guess I, I suppose it does. Okay. Look, <laughs> the little pet character like died. Oh yeah, can't forget to save. Old King Cole. Oh yeah, he's right. What? King Cole? <laughs> Thanks for playing. Star Saba, we're finally playing again. You guys need to learn some patience. Alright, so Bottles' house it is, but let me just have a quick look. <laughs> Pot Kettle Black is when you insult someone about the trait you have yourself. Oh! Oh, we do have that... We do have the same saying in Finnish, but I didn't really understand it because, you know, I've never heard it in English. Okay, so it's just the Binjo houses. Let's go into Bottles' house. I hate reading, that's not in my gamer blood! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save here and quickly grab some uh, uh, snot paper. I will leave you guys with a video and I will be back in like five seconds. Hang on. Uh, yeah, here we go. Oh shit, I actually made it back in time. Alright. Now I can focus on Banyor. Guys. My, my chair has started squeaking again. Listen to this. It's not doing it when I'm talking about it. Hang on. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. That's a good squeak. Listen to this. Yeah, there we go. Oh, oh. One more time. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's let's finally play some banjo. Maybe we can even enter a level finally. Do I ever plan on streaming Sonic Roboblast 2 again? There's a few popular mods that give the game a new plot, different zones, new bosses and all that stuff. Yes, I do plan. Classic frame is almost... Okay, nice. Still hanging on the old... <laughs> it's the chair farting excuse. Yes. No, I mean, no, 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 because, you know, it is the chair. Your chair is even worse. Bottles hole. Oh no, Bottles is family. Wait, what? That's 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 the pizza song. You know. I can't believe it. Hello there, Banjo. How are we today? Oh, pretty good, Mr. Mr. Puddle Balls and yourself? Oh, fine, fine. The little part goes, the boy. Keep quiet, Kazooie. What was that? Is Boros okay? He should be back from the Sparrow Mountains for his dinner soon. 
He never misses his dinner, you know? <laughs> uh, I'm sure he'll be back soon. How do you pronounce MRS again? Is it mistress or uh, missus or uh, miss? Which one is it? Also, I can't believe this is real. Like, you were joking about it, her son dying. Missus, okay. On the Pizza Tower reference, now you have to buy 3 plushies, 12 shirts, and pre-order the game again. <laughs> it's Mrs. Okay. Oh, it's down in it. I can't this fucking music! I can't believe it's real. Pizza music. That was the fucking Raymond. Hang on. Why did I just hear the llama sound effect but reversed? Who did that? Who did this? Who did this? Was it the enemy respawning? Hang on, listen to this. Listen to this. Okay, it's not playing again. I, I think it was the respawn sound. There it is! That's used in Rayman! Rayman 2! It's one of the lums, I'm pretty sure, but reversed. I even used that in Redemption, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, good luck with Punch 2, I saw. Hang on. This is very daunting for the first playthrough. Yeah, I hear it's a lot bigger and such. Look at the third bookcase, second shelf from the top. No fucking way. No fucking way. fuck was that music that was playing? What the fuck? Um... <laughs> Game ruined. <laughs> Why am I showing you books? It was Red Sus Among Us. Hang on, where's the door? Here we go. <laughs> fuck off! <laughs> Yo, baby. Yo, that's Donkey Kong. Hello, Pancho. Hello, Goggles. Since you and Daddy are such good friends, I'll give you these prototype glasses he's working on. Did he finish working on them? Oh, yes, I believe they're called the Mezo Gaze glasses. How do they work? Well,. When you punch your eyes, we have used left and right to zoom in and out. Not bad! I can't believe Bottles had a, a wife and a child and now he's dead. Hey, it's a reference to another, another rare game. Doom. I'm looking for collectibles, but there's like no collectibles in this game so far. Maybe later. Everywhere I go, that peel-shaped visor fuck is hiding in plain sight. Hey. <laughs> Another child. Hey there, Banjo. Hi, oh, Spooky. Me and my dad are going to be playing in the kickball tournament next week. 
Oh, what at the Mayan Stadium. King Jungling has organized it especially for my dad, since he's such a hero. I don't suppose you have any substitutes? Why would we need a substitute? My dad is the best on the team. I'm sure he was. Uh, uh, is. And did you know that tunnel over there is my secret way out of the village? You might find it useful. We already know that. King Danglinga is a personal friend of ours. We opened it up especially for us. Nice. <laughs> Like, that guy doom? Yeah, exactly. In Yokalele, they are opposites. Oh my god, what is this? Is that also from Doom? <laughs> I'm sure he was. Damn, Bunja, damn! Allo Hags, Wooden Hollow. <laughs> Bunja about to change bottle, says Wikipedia page from it to was. I'm Jiggy Wiggy, this is my temper. You wanna see me? You'll need to get past my doorman first. What the fuck? We have a man with a Jiggy for a head? Well, this certainly was unexpected. <laughs> Look at those trees! You know, feels like I could walk right into the forest. <laughs> <laughs> Bottles Fox. His son is the exact size as Banjo. Bottles did fuck. At least twice. It has been proven. Okay, this is probably a level entrance. Let me talk to Big Big Mac Jiggy Head. Forest.jpg, yeah. Okay, there's another way over there. Oh, stop following me. Fuck off. I stole the joke from you. What joke? Big b b b jiggy mac jigama head. I'm a lowly. I work the door of his sacred temple to keep out those who are not worthy. Sounds like fun! Do you think we are worthy? That depends. To prove yourself worthy to enter. Yeah. Must collect images in the form of Jiggy Wiggy. And what might these images look like? Jigsaw pieces, also known as Jiggies. That sounds familiar! Let's see what you have then. It seems you have collected enough jiggies to be allowed inside. We have collected one single jiggy, and it was given to us. I guess we are worthy. Oops. <laughs> Is born. Fox dies. Bottles completed. <laughs> Life cycle. <laughs> Why does it sound like the Jiggy Head burps when he talks? <laughs> Jiggy Rob's voice hurts your ears. <laughs> Big Mac Jiggy. You called him Big Mac and did a McDonald's reference? Holy fuck. Okay, here we are. Jiggy Wiggy's temple. Oh, it's just another man. Greetings, O Chosen One. You have entered the sacred temple of Jiggy Wiggy. Approach the golden monolith if you wish to prove yourself worthy. I like this world building, but it also came out like out of the left left with the left When Fortune smiles here will be written the Jiggy Secrets. 
When fortune smiles, here we Okay, okay, same thing. Do you wonder what would happen if they connected their heads together? <laughs> yeah! Press B when near the monolith to attempt Jiggy Wiggy's challenge one. You like how you can see Bunja's reflection? Oh yeah, I wonder if that's an actual reflection or one of those clever fake mirrors in games. Animated right beatbox emote when that would actually be very fitting. Just gotta figure out how to animate beatboxing. Maybe like <laughs> maybe like the uh, you know the Morshu. Oh, I should save. Oh fuck, when did I save last time? You must complete the image before if you wish to travel to where it shows. Use the control stick to guide your hand. Press A to pick up a piece. Well, okay, so this is just the bottles mini game again. I'm gonna save here. Press A, return to the outside. Okay, okay. That's not right. Oh fuck yeah, the image does not look well. I'm sure I can still do this. It doesn't look that bad. I just gotta like uh, match the crossed colors. Nope. There we go. Look, this isn't that bad. There we go. Now let's see where we will end up. You have completed Jiggy Wiggy's challenge one, so now the great one will show you the way. Yeah, it wasn't that bad. So is this like where you go to different worlds? Instead of like Grunty's whatever land. Behold the power of the mighty crystal jiggy. <laughs> oh, they just fucking recorded Podge just sat standing there like... Pfft. It's the TNC circle, yeah. Whoa. You do not have enough jiggies to attempt challenge two. Come back later when you do. Okay, thank you. Let's finally go to a level. <laughs> One frame bunch of 2 gaming. First, let me take a look over here. Come back when you're little. Mm, Richard, yo! Good old Jinjo! Yippee, you saved me! I'm all for home now! Jinjo. <laughs> I like the loading screens. Bottles' Revenge. It's a scrap multiplayer feature where the second player would have controlled Bottles' evil spirit. They would have been able to possess enemies and originally bosses. It was cut at the last moment as it can be re-enabled, albeit in an almost unfinished state via Game Shark or something. What the fuck? That's so weird! Hell yeah. Ginyo. <laughs> there are evil Jinjos called Minjos. I'm sure I'll uh, figure that out when I find them. Okay, let's just uh, go into the level. This is Jiggy Wiggy's Altar of Knowledge. 
could just be to view the mighty one's wisdom. You want another spoiler? I'm good. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh god, we got a face. Oh shit, we got epic music. Can I crawl? I don't think I can. The fart music. It's like a Moomba world. Are you evil? Ah, oh, you're evil! This is a warp pad! Find another one in this world, and you'll be able to warp back between them. Okay. Okay, I don't think I can do anything with that. Yes, here we go, finally! You found some notes, boy! No come and find me! Finally collectibles. You love this level's music. It has the threatening aura that indicates this game won't be messing around. This game really did just make two ways of making the same action of warping. <laughs> yeah. It's Bombo Pad. Bombo stand on it to perform great magic. Walrus? The mighty shiny one sleeps under his surface as I record once again! Why is, like, he telling us what the signs say? Why can't Bungie just read himself? Are these bears? Or tigers, I can't quite tell. They look like bears. What the hell? You've collected a skill stop, honeycomb! Press B to stop your edge bars close to the top as possible! <laughs> Pointless minigame. Unless you get, like, a lot of more base health. Later. Oh my god. Do I feed you? Nah. Do I crush you? Nah. <laughs> okay, they are tiger, I just heard. It's the Tons Temple, holy fuck. Let me through. Stop right there. What do you want? We want to go in there. As it sounds cool. Of course it's cool. Everyone wants to see the stony kickball gamma games. <laughs> Stay the side then, Bozo. We'll miss the action. Bozo, I'm Officer Ungopaz and there ain't no tickets left. They just sold out while you were playing a banjo kazooie. We don't want to watch. We're here to kick pop and win. Nice try, but I'm afraid you can't. The games are only open to stonies. <laughs> Stoners? Oh, go on. Nope. How about a bribe? How dare you? This is a respectable organization. Get lost, both of you. Guess we ain't going in there yet. How did you perform the big jump again? Ah, oh, okay. Ah, okay. <laughs> Bozo. Okay. Wow! <laughs> no, I don't want to do that again. I'm, al I'm already at full health. Tons tribe. Hey, 
got your sorry hat over here. Uh, press B. That's guy mole. Kill Sergeant Jam Jam's reporting for duty, sir. I'm joking a lot of this, Bozo. <laughs> he looks like bottles in the uniform. Course I look like bottles, you punk. He's my brother. How's the gig keeping? Anyhow, not too good. Recently deceased at the hands of Grundy, the witch. Sorry to hear that, flea ball. Did he go out fighting? Playing cards, actually. Typical! So you'll be wanting to learn some of my special moves to get even with the witch, huh? Not really. Bottles taught us loads in, in the last game. Ha! He only knew novice moves. You'll get nowhere without my advanced technique techniques. <laughs> Sounds good to us, jam jars. Why don't we just a few? Oh my god, the eyes. Not that easy, punk! You gotta prove you sorry self first by collecting me a few notes. Come back if you can't find enough. Hey, wait a minute. I see you got enough notes for my first lesson. <laughs> Listen and learn, you punks! What you need is an aiming sight, hit the target, then you might. First person view by pressing up, hit Z to fire with accuracy. Okay, it wasn't even rhyming. Fighting it tough, huh? Looks like you need some rations. What the fuck is he talking about? That'll be all. Dismiss! <laughs> this fucking guy. Oh. Yeah, new emotes. Yes, we also have the animated one if you didn't know this yes, yet. You wish Bonjo would just brute force their way through a guard. <laughs> the keepsake Bozo. I love Bozo. Okay, let's try this uh, new thing out. What was it again? So press up and then Z. Oh, so you can like aim. What's, what's Z? Oh, there we go. Holy fuck, why is, why is... That's not supposed to happen? Wait, did I do it? I guess I did. Cool. <laughs> First person egg aiming but crusty, yeah. Nope. It moves way too like weird. Like when you try to do a small movement it just like <laughs> There we go. Oh yeah, shoot save. You have activated in this world! Oh, I missed that. I was reading chat. Whatever. I don't think he was being important anyway. <laughs> Call off Banjo. <laughs> Banjo Kadumi. <laughs> Alright, let's see. What the hell? Mambo Skull? Is this Mambo's like main home? You got a Globo! They're supposed to have magical powers! Fuck. <laughs> Can't wait for him to give Banjo a gun. Mumbo, we, we have a world to save. And here you are sleeping. <sighs> Mumbo Jumbo? From Minecraft? Oh, Bear and Bird, here at last. Mumbo, best shaman in game. So build new skull. <sighs> Sorry, I just keep yawning. I don't know why. It's all the reading. 
We got a Globo! Must give magic creature to Mumbo, it won't help. Want Mumbo's help? Yes. Sure, we need all the help we can get. Throw it in Mumbo's bag. Ah, oh, Mambo get to be hero at last. Press B to see mighty shaman zap stick. Return me to my chair when want to be bear and bird again. Holy shit, we're playing as Moomba. Oh, he's fast! Use the giant shiny one to open the huge stone doors. Oh my god, Mambo has magic abilities. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, Mambo, take a screedy. Sorry, I fell off. I don't understand what you're talking about now. Of course, the enemies respawn. Yes, <laughs> screedy. Oh! Can I dive as Mambo? No. Isn't that like a gamer term for, sc for a screenshot? Yeah, I know that, but the Moomba Yumba talk. <laughs> I like the feathers on his head just going. Press B to see mighty Mumbo magic. Yeah, <laughs> your confusion. <laughs> Hope this works. Oh, a big man. <laughs> Mumba music. Mumba magic make golden Goliath rise. Magic only lasts short time. To control me again, return statue to its base and press B. Oh my god, we're just like hopping from character to character. This is amazing. Yay! You're going down, statue! Boom! Do I have enough time to kick the other ones too? Alright, see ya dude. Boom! This world feels very Crash Bandicoot. I wonder why. But yeah, I do agree. Let me go up here. Maybe there's something up here. Whoa! Oh, there's a Jiggy at the top. Okay, I guess we can return to Mambo. Oh, big boy. Scary he's a bunger humpscare. Oh, I can't even get out of the water now. Mambo magic run out! Oh, it's the rock door I need to destroy. Ow! Did I still get to keep the stone? Okay, I did. Oh, but the enemies respawned. Oh, it's a flying pad. Let's do this again. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go get the big one. Yeah, 69 time. Boom. There we go. Let's see if I can keep 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 open. <laughs> let's see if I can kick open the second one. 
<laughs> lyrics be like mumbo noises. There were only two doors, right? Bada boom! Oh. Bada boom! Bada boom! Okay, you only like break a little bit of it. I see. Do you like you can play as Mambo? Yes! I love playing as different characters. Mambo, take me home! There we go. Europa <laughs> like football. Alright, Mumba. Yeah, kicking the statues doesn't matter because they just respawn. Oh no! When did I save? Ah! Ah! Uh oh. Gotta remember to uh, save more often. Uh, inside, bon job, boom, whatever. Not too bad, not too bad. <laughs> Crash counter, two. Can I skip this dialogue, please? Okay, I can. Awesome. I can't? Okay, just press all buttons. Throw it in Bombo's bag. I gotta remember to at least save after every cutscene. <laughs> Can someone keep track of the amount of crashes? Yeah, <laughs> we'll try, we'll try. That was number two. Make sure to collect the crystals, please, Cortex. <laughs> He's turned over a new leaf and really needs your help. Oop, oop. Nice. Hope this works. <sighs> Can't skip this one either. Oh well. It's my fault for not saving. This game is full of bugs like Donkey Kong 64. I haven't encountered any bugs yet. <laughs> Has anyone made a Golden Freddy joke yet? <gasps> no! But you could be the first one. <laughs> Why did Crash 2 spoil its own plot in the title? Because it was never a secret. It's not like these days when everyone tries to make a twist villain and keep it a secret and fail miserably. <laughs> this bro looks like Golden Freddy be like, holy shit! Real. That was his mistake! <laughs> yeah, exactly! Holy fuck, can I go in here? I can. Have I played Crash 4? Yes, it was my game of the year last year. Jade Snake Grove. Grove. Kicking. Oh my god, I'm drowning in shit. Oh yeah, got you off. 2020, because yeah, I forgot we're in 2022. I should play Hat in Time. I do want to play it at some point, but... You know. I also, speaking of Crash 4, I do want to stream it. Maybe after this game I will. Let 
let's do that again. Scrimble Bimble 2, Twist Villain's Wrath. It's amazing, so I hear. <laughs> but what about Crash 6? What's Crash 6? I had the time gets good after the first level. See, normally I would give you shit, you know, like, do I need to watch fucking 10 seasons of something before it gets good? But I actually trust your opinion, so... I'll play it uh, at some point. Two, we might honestly last a, last a while. Yeah, it's cool. I actually like the Scringle Beam Blow that lasts a long time. Even Bonjo 1 wasn't that short, so I'm actually quite excited. Can I kick open this door? Yes, I can! Amazing. Just kicking open everything. Same dumb kangaroo moved on your island in Animal Crossing. Holy fuck, these fucking kangas needs to be stopped. Okay. <laughs> that lies, what do you mean? Beware that hats, Hat in Times DLC is a mixed bag. It adds one of the worst levels in the game. See, one of my friends said that the DLC has the best levels in the game, so it's really all down to opinion. This game is incredibly ambitious for its time, yeah, and I gotta applaud it for that. Boogity boo, is fucking massive! It's enormous! There are no levels, everything is one big map with interconnect that interconnects itself. That's really cool, I just hope I don't get lost. It gets grindy towards the end. Do we gonna like grind bunges like fucking gamer levels? I'm glad I didn't know anything about this game beforehand because maybe I would have been scared of it too. I hear laughing. Oh, magic rat. That's the rat. Oh. We kind of scared you after playing Kazooie and jumping to this game. It's a lot different than Kazooie in that respect. Yeah, maybe it's good that I didn't play it right after the first one then. <laughs> Is this a new FNAF mecha? Absolutely enormous. Just Fucking massive. Hat in time DLC is really disappointing from a scale sense. No bosses or anything. I see. Who is a Umber looking ass, dude? Umber. Umber! Some freaking Luke Hadorbert moved to your Animal Crossing Island as well. You hate his eyes. Dude, just get rid of them. Just kill them. <laughs> you would kill him if you could. Oh my god. Scary. Here we go. Have I played Batman Arkham games? No, I haven't. They don't look that interesting, but if I ever do want to tackle Batman, I'll, I'll check those out. I hear the first one is good. Or wait, was it the second one? Either, either way, one of them is good, according to people. And one of them is a broken mess. <laughs> oh, Banya spinning! Huh? What was the biggest challenge when making a redemption? Oh boy. Uh... I guess... Just learning stuff. Let's 
go over here first. Nuts and Bolts is a mix between Donkey Kong 64 and Punch series. Um, it's even three times larger and explore based. And you can go on a world inside the 64, uh, no, 360 machine, and you will find a copy of Punch Kazooie 360 Xbox. Okay. <laughs> nice. The second one is the best. Arkham City. Okay, yeah. So I've heard. Oh my god. Ah. No. No. There we go. Yeah, Kazooie! Yes. A good vista point. Oh, I kind of miss that uh, jiggy jingle, like, I don't miss the animation, the animation was really long and just, you know, stupid, but I miss the jingle, you know, you know, I miss the ending part, that was always fun. What was the biggest challenge when adding fart cushion to redesigner, uh, making the new sprite? What surprises you is how they managed to fit this entire game with the huge world and the increasing light effects into the cartridge. And keep in mind, this wasn't the game that took the most space. That honor actually goes to Conker's Bad Fur Day. Oh, Conker's Bad Fur Day is actually something I do wanna... Do wanna stream. Here's a move that's all of fun! Now use Kazooie as a bomb! Handheld gun! Z fires eggs both. Okay, okay. That'll be all. Dismiss. Wait, how how do I use Kazooie as a gun? Conqueror's Bad Fur Day not like saucy? Yeah, it's like 18 plus. It has sex and like violence and gore and everything in it. Go to the temple? Oh yeah. Oh, the gun is only in the temple, I see. Oh shit, here we go. <laughs> oh, what? Spyro? Dude. This is actually pretty cool. Okay, I can't strafe. Oh, I see you have mastered the art of bird handling. I now challenge you to collect the sacred statues and find your prize. What a voice. Bunja finally got a gun. <laughs> there he goes. Hang on. Oh, I don't, I don't know how to play first-person games with a keep uh, 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 controller. This is gonna be hard. He <laughs> could have had it collected on dopamine. Play Banjo Tooie for first-person Kazooie action.
This is weird. I never play gun games with controllers. This feels very weird. Okay, let's hug the right wall. No jumping. <gasps> Woo! Okay. You were gonna say before your internet died. Uh, you would think the hardest part of designing Redemption would have been Playtopia, but I digress. Well, not really. I don't really know what was the hardest part. I just kind of made it. I don't remember being like really stuck and racking my head on anything really. Oop, there we go. All the enemies respawn, okay. <laughs> Bandoom. <laughs> the hardest part of making a game is making the game. I guess you could say that. Oh my god, the scream. Like, <laughs> No, knowing right level design was never the hardest part. Yeah, I love making levels. Level design is most definitely not the hardest part for me. Oh, there we go! Then Stachel Kenshu entered my slightly sacred chamber. Slightly sacred chamber? Are those golden eggs I see? Hang on, where does this go? I think you still remember the secret rooms in this level? What the fuck? Played this game? <laughs> Microsofts are cowards for not adding a Kazooie gun in Halo. That would be amazing, but also weird. <laughs> yeah? Cool. Right of the golden eggs is a secret room. Okay, I'll I'll take a look. I shall take a look once I go there. <laughs> Yo! Oh! Scary. What's that ginyo? Hard part is holding back on how difficult you can make it. How to take how to take into account that everyone besides you have no idea what's coming. That's true. Difficulty balancing is really hard. That's why redemption was kinda it wasn't such an issue in redemption because, you know, I was just copying Raymond 1. And you can tell that the custom levels and bonus levels are already like, you know, nerve-wracking. So yeah, balancing the difficulty is definitely the hardest. Oh shit. Open sesame. Kazooie Kumi. There are secret rooms here, but I don't know how to open them. <laughs> Todd Strike member jump scare. You never thought this is a lost Nether 64 Call of Duty with eggs. Third forest bonus level age here like 50 years. But those were supposed to be hard, so I don't regret those ones, but yeah. Slightly sacred chamber. You need to press a button on the doors. Is this real? Can anyone else confirm this? Because I tried pressing buttons. Which button am I supposed to press?
maybe I need to get the the honey things. The bonus levels were a great challenge. <laughs> you just got angry. It's good to complete them though, yeah. Okay, you have to press jump. Most impressive mortal, 20 statues gains you entry to my really sacred chamber. Cool. Now let's try opening some doors, shall we? This really is like Doom. Here we go. Maybe this one opens. It does! Yeah, jump scare. What's the point of this room? Okay, this just takes me back here, so... Yeah, where was the... Hang on, the Jinjo is probably up behind the secret room. Yeah, here we go. There we go. Blue Jinjo. FPSs are full of jump scares on the 64, yeah. Impressive mortal, you figured out how the doors work. Hang on, wait, this is where I started, right? Yeah, this is where I started. Now I gotta... Uh... Um, figure out how to go back. I think the map is big because there is a... Four-player mode where they compete to do the objective. In, in this... Uh, this shooter map, you mean? Or the whole game? Does everyone play as Banjo Kazooie or are there like other characters? In the shooty areas, that's cool. Look, Banjo, that's not our Jiggy! This is just too easy, there's gonna be a boss. Well, we'll have the game finished in no time! Can I get the actual music? There we go. Shooting, prepare to be die, dark, ridden, doom. Did he just say doom? Okay, the game is already giving me music. I don't need to play my own. Sad. Oh my god, it's the boss from fucking Bendy at the ink machine. Oh, I can't feel my legs anymore! Get him, you worthless muggies! What the hell are muggies? Oh, they play as a recolored Banjo and Kazooie. Nice. No! Oh! Oui. Ah! No, when did I save? I don't think I saved a single time in the shooting uh, fucking first person thing. That's the third one. That's the third one. Oh no.
Please, when did I save? I gotta make it a habit. I gotta just keep saving. Is this before I found the secret rooms? No, I saved. <gasps> I saved before the boss. Yes. Nice. Look, Banjo, there's another Jackie. This is just too easy. Yep, we'll have the game finished in no time. Is it your emulator? Yeah. Old mortal, thought you'd get another jiggy that easily, eh? That's weird, but two at least auto saves. Yeah, and I I will try to keep more, do more of, save more often. Project 64 newest version of Froze for you. That's too bad. <laughs> no, what? I really don't like rare sense of humor. Oh my god, coming in here, all guns blazing. Like, big ol' hot takes. Actually, that's not a hot take. Their humor is very hit and miss, even to me. Wow! I don't really like it that no one takes anything seriously, but uh, it's not the worst. It's not the worst game like that I've seen. There are many stories, many games, many, many cartoons, many whatever, where characters just don't take anything seriously and it grinds my gears. In Banjo Kazooie, they don't take anything seriously and it's kinda... <sighs> but okay, it's not the worst one, it's not the worst one definitely, in my opinion at least. <laughs> British! It's British boomer humor, it's here all the time, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, the games are made by British boomers, so, you know, oh fuck. Ah! I'm gonna die! Rare isn't gonna make a new bunch, they could at least port the original to Steam, and that would be cool, but I think they are already licensed to, like, be on Xbox's platforms. Oh! Oh. Nice. <laughs> Bunch's line made you realize you don't like it. What did Bunch say that made you realize? Conquer was built up as one of the funniest games before you played it. Who surprised how many jokes missed? <laughs> yeah, Conquer is another one I'm like afraid, in the sense that like people are like you know, it's the best funny, but I don't think it will be. We'll see when I do end up playing Conquer. It depends on one's taste, absolutely. Like humor is the most subjective thing ever. Whoa! Okay, he just blew himself up. <laughs> Save is coming, Gregory. We talked about this. That would be cheating. Panjo said something like, we're going to beat the game in no time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the fourth wall breaking. They know they're in the game. I don't really like that. Other Microsoft games are on PC. And by that mean you mean Steam. But how about Rare games? I feel like Rare games are locked in like a weird limbo for some reason. Let chat decide. Decide what? Your finish lesson! 
Ooh. Sea of Thieves is on Steam? Yeah, but sorry, let me rephrase that. How about other old pre-Microsoft acquisition rare games? Are they on PC? Because I feel like they're locked in a weird limbo. Bottle. Okay, Bottle is a good one. Bottle in Finnish is Pullo. Pullo. I can do joke another time. Pullo. Sea of Thieves is the only game Rare is interested in. You mean Sea of Thieves is the only game they are allowed to work on? Don't blame the devs. You think Battletoads is... Oh yeah, arcade game, right. Oh, sus face. Ah! At least port Rare Replay on Steam. That would be good. Yeah, Rare Replay I hear is like the definitive way to play these games. Here we go. The devs have openly said that they are free to do whatever they want and they choose pirate game. Oh, well, then it's fine. Keep in mind that the devs are not the same as back in the day. So they have no, like, attachment to the old series. What is this? There's secret rooms everywhere. <laughs> You're saying that like Sea of Thieves is bad or something. Yeah, Sea of Thieves is most definitely not bad. It's a really fun game. But I can understand the feeling of, you know, your favorite company that used to be something different doing just... Okay, here's an example. Here's an example. Uh, a personal experience. Naughty Dog. They used to be the cream of the crop and nowadays they nowadays they just do boring uh, realistic Big Mac shoot them up fuck zombie zombie fucking and fucking abuse their workers and you know they used to be something they used to be something good Jack and Daxter please bring back Jack and Daxter but uh, the company has changed the only thing that remains the same is the name, so, you know, I can understand feeling depressed about Rare's current state, but really, they are doing good. Unlike Naughty Dog. The funny old Rare Boomers are making funny, funny Yokalele. Yeah, if you if you want Banjo kazooie 3, play Yokalele. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> Battletoads had a weird revival recently. Yeah, I noticed. It looks really cool. I like the art style of that a lot. But I'm not into beat em ups. I think I got everything in here. Rare Replay has like 30 of Rare's most important games from the Xerax Spectrum days all the way up to 2008. That's cool. I, I thought it only had like the Nintendo 64 ones. And for only $30, plus with some neat bonus features, it's a good deal for what you can see. Yeah, it would be cool if it was on PC, true. Finally done with that segment. Do you really want them to bring back Jack and Daxter? Uh, no, I don't. I don't want uh, the current Naughty Dog to bring back Jack and Daxter, but I would like for Jack and Daxter to return. You really want Jack and Dexter back one day. Yeah, exactly. Uh, let's see. I couldn't enter that place yet. I think it's blocked. Maybe I can... Maybe I can kick open that door. Jack 1 brings back good memories. Jack 1, 2 and 3 are so good. So good. Oh, brown ginger. ginger. <laughs> Reddit link spotted. Woo! 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 
don't know, I think. Yeah, it's the Jack 4 concept art pictures. Honestly, this was in like... Was it in like 2010 or something? That's to be expected from that decade, that year. But if they were to tackle Jack these days, they would... Maybe. I, I keep saying they as in like Naughty Dog, but I'm not talking about Naughty Dog. I'm, I'm talking about like the industry. If Jack and Daxter were to return these days, they could be cartoony and fun like they used to be. Because Naughty Dog are a lost cause. They are not making good games anymore. Oh, look at this cow. We found a cow. Look at the state of poor Bovina's field. This plague of filthy flies is scoffing my crops. Oh dear, how can we help? Get rid of the pesky flies, of course. Say your prayers, flies! The concept art reeks of the era it was made in. Video games were bad back then, yeah. Video games really did have a little slump in quality in the, like, PS3 era. Oh no. How am I supposed to aim like this? Okay, let me save scan this. There we go. But right, The Last of Us 2 won all the Game of the Year awards in 2020. It means it's a good game, right? And the company totally hasn't abused its workers, right? <laughs> exactly. Oh my god. Here we go. Those for Bobs are making Call of Duty games now. No, no they aren't. They are helping with the development of Call of Duty, but that doesn't mean they are only working on Call of Duty. In our half of the crop jokes, lady, I believe you owe us a jiggy. Well, I guess I do. Sloop. Let's get that jiggy. In the new Jack and Daxter. Uh, <laughs> Ratchet and Clank. They showed a lot of Easter eggs for all the uh, PS2 timelines, like Jack 2. Yeah, I love oh the Easter egg, uh, the Jack 2, uh, Jack and Daxter cameo in Ratchet and Clank. Warm my heart, it really did. In new Ratchet and Clank, P oh wait, I read it already. Bowser's Inside Story. I haven't played any of the Mario RPGs. I'm not huge on Mario. Oh, what the fuck is this? Nice one, punk! Treble clefs are worth a mighty 20 notes! Oh, nice. It's a treble clef, or however you pronounce it, but I know that from Rayman. The quote unquote PS3 years were when you stopped playing new console games completely for a while and slowly discovered PC gaming. Yeah, because games were bad! <laughs> That's also when indie started to like become a thing. In Ratchet 2, they showed the Jack 1 animation victory cutscene. Yeah, I, I've seen a video of that. It's like a nice little Easter egg. I like it very much. Oh fuck, I need to kick the ball again. Western AAA non Nintendo games anyway. Well, it's not that Nintendo didn't have good good games that era. Everyone did, but Nintendo was also in that slump with their Wii shenanigans and their targeting casual gamers shenanigans. And there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with targeting casual gamers, etc. <laughs> but it made it so that there weren't a lot of games I was interested in personally. Ooh, PlayStation 3 games, poo-poo, uh-oh, stinky. 
All you played on the 360 and PS3 era was basically Hollow 3 and Rayman Origins. Yeah. Oh wait, Mumbo is this way. There was no company back then that wasn't in the slump. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Rai, more like fry. Oh my god. I'm gonna I'm gonna get you for those words. Halo 3 and Rayman Origins were basically the same game. <laughs> yeah! No difference. Made by the same company. Take me, Mumbo. It was the must be gritty era. Yeah. 2010 is when Xenoblade dropped, though. I don't like Xenoblade. You didn't grow up with Nintendo. You grew up with PlayStation series. And back in 2015, you found Nintendo way fascinating. Yeah, it's, it's funny because PlayStation started with a lot of Scrimble Bimblos and then they got like stopped. So a lot of people like transitioned or discovered Nintendo that way. Hello, Kingpin, dude! Dude! Kingu Pingu. That's what we call him out over here. You like Xenoblades too? I hear it's good, but it's not for me. PlayStation Home was the best thing about PlayStation 3. What was PlayStation Home? Was it the fucking channel or market or whatever? You're now going to refrain from trying to defend 2010s because all it's spawning is hot takes. No, no, they're not hot takes. They are valid takes. And I'm glad we're all grown-ups here so we can respect each other's video game opinions. You actually think you liked Origins a lot more than you would have because it was one of the only five games of that era to use more than just muddy brown green colors. Exactly. Everyone, everything looked like shit and I don't, I don't mean shit like bad. I mean shit like brown shit color, you know. <laughs> There are eight people in chat that have lied about their age. Shh. Let's not call out lurkers. No, oh, you know. Let's not call out people. Of course, there were some good games in 2010, but overall the video game industry was in a bit of a weird slump around the time, yeah. Xenoblade 2 gets too much flack from people who have not played it. I will say that. That's true, a lot of games do. Especially if they're popular, and Xenoblade 2 is popular, so therefore people hate it. <laughs> Nub. Oh, Banyo. Origins is a beautiful game. You still prefer Rayman 1's aesthetic. Yo, let's go, let's go. Uh, the most in the series, but the devs were clearly talented. Yeah, Origins and Legends are mwah, beautiful! I'm telling ya. But the Rayman one is still the best. The ultimate art style. PlayStation Home was a virtual 3D social gaming platform. Wait, like the metaverse that Facebook is pushing? <laughs> Fucking... Uh, what was the dude called again? Mark Zuckerberg, like, over here turning into, like, a bald 3D model. Oh my god, I hate the metaverse so much. <laughs> yeah, but better. I believe that, yes, everything's better than fucking metaverse. Oh no, I didn't want the golden ones. <laughs> Actually, yes. What's cool about the Origins and Legends styles is they both have really cool styles for different reasons, so both stand out on their own. Yeah. Mark Zuckerberg, more like fart fucker turd. 
<laughs> I prefer fucker. Yeah, end of sentence where you're expecting something else. Okay, let's fly! Fly! Check Facebook into the metaverse. to play like SNES and stuff, but playing Nintendo 64 like this was hell. Uh, you mean like the vir Virtua Console? The Wii U these days is worth it for a Virtual Console alone. Uh, didn't they like shut down the fucking shop so you can't even like buy the Virtual Console games anymore? What do you mean, Facebook? Don't you mean Meta? Oh yeah. <laughs> we use failure pushed Nintendo to do really good things. Too bad they're going compl complacent again. But so is the cycle of Nintendo. It's not only Nintendo. It's every fucking gaming giant out there. When they're doing bad sales wise they have to actually start doing good things but when they're doing good when they're at the top they start getting arrogant and they start slipping sony is in that situation at the moment sony is doing very arrogant things and are slipping so they need to start doing good things again if they want to like recapture people's like opinions xbox is doing good at the moment because they were doing bad previously and Nintendo is also sleeping. It's it's an endless cycle of epic gaming. Are there any other places I have to fly to? Let me take a look. <laughs> up until the middle of last year, you thought Metaverse was a thing Persona 5 made up. Might as well be. You can buy the Wii U stuff, but you have to use vouchers. Okay, interesting. The Wii U shop is still open. The Wii one closed in 2019. Well, the Wii U one is gonna close so too soon. Then. They took away credit card support for the Wii U and 3DS eShops. Sonic Game Pass is a good step though. Yeah, but it's been a lot of... of around, that's the word. It's been around for a while already. That's why there's no amiibos in future. They add Super Mario 3D World stamps to use it on Miiverse. Comp yeah, that's true. When Miiverse was like deleted, all these like weird stamp features and stuff are so useless. <laughs> oh, look at that like fade off in the world. That's, that's really cool. Makes it like blend in. I think we got everything. <laughs> or you could just yarrr. Yes, that's what I'm doing right now. Actually, what? Hmm? Okay, I think we got everything by flying, so let's go down here. Banyo bunyo bo. Banyo bunyo, banyo bunyo, bunyo, banyo bunyo bo. There we go. The rumored Game Pass thing is different from PlayStation Now though. What's PlayStation Now? I don't I'm not up to speed with the Sony stuff. Pink Jinjo, that's cool. Listen up to what you told on the edges you can hold! 
move along with the greatest of ease. Put on B to attack what you please. Okay, some of them rhyme, some of them don't, that's weird. That'll be all. Dismiss! It supposedly has placed as one, two, and three games. Ah, I, I believe it when I see it. They'll probably drip, drip feed them like Nintendo does. The Pingyo. The only Pingyo in the city. Oh, it's a white ginger. No wonder it's the only one. I thought I'd never find my way home! Take this jiggy for your trouble! No Banjo and Rayman both had to learn to grab ledges. You love the new emotes? Hell yeah. The clown. They're the follower emotes, so everyone can use them. These stone tools are weird. This way had the had the mud. I don't think I can go in there. Okay, I can, but okay, I can't. It's weird how there's only one white ginger, but there's like nine black gingers. I think it's. Like, they go in order. So one family has one, one family has two, one family has three, then four, five, six, seven, nine. I think it's like that, because I saw there were four brown ones and seven blue ones. So it starts with it starts and ends with the non-colors, white and black, I think. hear someone sleeping. What inspired me to do the clown bread? Uh, you guys wanted a clown emote? Thought you'd steal slumber's gold while he sleeps, did you? Well, yeah, to be honest. But I heard you coming, clumsy bear. Oh! I will never do that voice ever again. Tiptoe? Okay, don't tell me what to do before I ask for help, please. You still don't have the follower emotes on your channel. Drop down, Banjo! Oh my god. Splendid! They seem to have gone. Must get some sparse sleep. Let's see if I can do that. No, it's the platform. When I step on the platform, it wakes up. Oh, this corner doesn't have the brushes, uh, bushes or whatever. Awesome. And now it doesn't wake up anymore. We got some shit on the walls, but I don't think I can do anything with that. Let's try going inside. E -O -R -E -O. Oh fuck, what the hell? Secret hole! Oh, I'm too, too large. Is this also an FPS, like, area? Oh no, it's a uh, cold chamber. You got jump scared in Animal Crossing? How? Oh, no, no. 
this isn't any use to you as you haven't earned any of my cheats yet. Well gee, thanks. This is where you activate my cheats. Stand on this podium if you want to. Well, I don't know any cheats yet, so... No need to do that. The fucking... <laughs> red lamb sound again. You are digging for shells on the beach and suddenly the dumb kangaroo that move in just ran at you with a speech bubble that was PEPPERMINT in capital letters and it was a sudden you got jump scared. <laughs> awesome. Here's the TP or whatever they're called. You should check on your Animal Crossing Island. Oh yeah, I remember you had one. Eat heap, welcome! I'm Banjo and my feather friend is Kajui! Me Humba Woomba, best magic person on island! Oh no. We heard that Mumbo was the best! Not true! Mumbo amateur, Woomba best! You bring globe magic creatures here! You have globo! Want to give to Humba? Oh yeah yeah, the worm. Yeah. Sure, I'll just throw it in. Magic ready. Jump in Woomba pool. Woomba? Like in Crash Bandicoot Woomba? <laughs> uh. Oh no, here we go. What the fuck? Umba cult is stony. Use control stick to move and press B for big head barge attack. Jump back into Wumba pool when I want when want to be bear and bird again. Okay. They were also nuts and balls that didn't look that awful. <laughs> I should play nuts and balls after all of these. Head, but maybe with this I can like do something with the statues. Under the strong rocks, you will find many surprises. <laughs> ok. Look at this stone bunja though. It's actually quite cute. Not to bolt this another game that's overrated. Okay, what the fuck? Everyone hates nuts and bolts. What do you mean? What world are you living in? <laughs> Maybe I should ask what YouTubers are you watching instead? Only the giant gold man can cross this quicksand to get the. Okay, so this dude just gives. Oh, you meant overhated. Autocorrect ruined it. Okay, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, that makes more sense. Yeah, I, ag I agree. I, I, f I hear it's actually a good game. People hate it just because of Jontron and like other epic funny gamer YouTubers who like shit on it, but the game isn't bad. You know, fucking big, big, big fuck YouTuber man goes like, WOW! THIS GAME FUCKING SUCKS! And he has like 2 million uh, watchers and they're all kids and they just grow up being like, It sucks, 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 you know. You haven't launched your Switch in like 3 months. It's been catching dust ever since you got a gamer laptop. That happens with a lot of games. I I remember we... Oh, hang on. Shoot the giant stone once between the eyes. Okay. I remember we talked about this in the past already, but it's good to mention it again because we were talking about, like, the game industry and such. A lot of games that people have nostalgia for are dictated by a handful of gamer YouTubers. I'm not saying some of them aren't like rightfully earned titles, you know, people are like, you know, oh, Castlevania is such a classic. Of course, Castlevania is a classic. 
but a lot of titles are dictated by the YouTube ecosystem and a lot of them are like Nintendo fans and people just like sponge that information in when they grow up and they've never played Castlevania in their life and then they're just like Yo, Castlevania is such a fucking classic, like... The croc effect, yeah. Exactly. Yeah, Super Mario RPG, yeah. People on the internet should start having their own opinions instead of ap adapting other people's opinions. Oh, Super Mario RPG is such a masterpiece, fucking... Such a classic RPG and no one talks about. Oh my god. Same goes for Star Fox Adventures. Now, I'm not saying Star Fox Adventures is a, is a great game, but it's a fine game. But just because um, certain J. Ontron made a video about it in the past, people just assume it's the worst game ever again. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Super Mario RPG sucks so hard. Yes! Actually, I haven't played it, so I can't say, but yes, don't be afraid to say it. <laughs> you said exactly what you think. People's opinions on games should not be created by a big people's thoughts. It's kind of toxic. So, hang on, what am I supposed to do with this tiny, tiny stone fella? This time I'm actually asking. I'm actually asking, so if you guys know what's the point, please tell me. <laughs> Jason Ontron. Star Fox Adventures is weird, but I think it has a lot of charm and interesting locations. Yeah, exactly. Star Fox. Talk to Tiger? Okay. Tons, I'm coming. You can play in the kickball tournament and also enter the other giant wall you smashed with the statue. Oh, yeah, 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 there was a tiny hole. To be fair, if you're someone like you who grew up with the shit cube era and only uh, learned about retro games via re-releases, re-releases, collections and YouTubers, it does sway your opinion. Yeah, exactly. What we talked about. <laughs> I'm back to the story. Can I come in and play? Mm, I don't know. That backpack looks kind of familiar. I'm saying we are very bird in an elaborate disguise. Trying to cheat our way in? Yes, it's pretty obvious. But they're a bit short on players, so you might as well go in anyway. <laughs> it shouldn't. That's weak shit. Yeah, it shouldn't. <laughs> Epic Wii fell off, ate a booger. Ratio. Twitter. Okay, now we can kick ball. We ended up liking a lot of things that people hate, so that should tell you something, yeah. Now I can just teleport back in if I wanna. That's why you've been screwing around with full sets. And such of late. What's a full set? Welcome to the Mayan Amateur Kickball Championship. You may enter the quarterfinals. But I'd advise you take a little training downstairs first. Some of your favorite games ever are obscure SNES and Genesis games barely anyone talks about. Yeah. Exactly. That's what I that's why I like that's actually like why I stream, just to play a bunch of games and form my own opinions on them. You've been rewatching a YouTuber you liked a lot, who does a lot of videos about animated films and he has eerily similar opinions to you. You fear people are gonna say you're copying your favorite animated films from, films from him. Oh shit, it, it really is Spyro! Oh, I'm at the top. Where am I supposed to, like, take this? How do I kick? Oh my god, this yellow dude. Why are they doing their own, like, goals? There we go. 
I guess I can't kick like the other ones can. What takes? Star Fox is a hardware dependent franchise. It was impressive back in the day, but nowadays the games are obsolete like F Zero. Well, I'm afraid you lost. That is fine, I can understand why you feel that way, but personally, I like Star Fox for the characters and stories and the potential. I agree, a lot of the games don't use that potential, but there is a lot of potential you could use. Oh my god, big wall text messages about video game opinions. Hang on, let me read these. Uh, you just like obscure or semi-obscure games. They have become favorite of yours. Heck, a certain series I love has currently taken over your brain cell. Actually, thanks to me that you discovered it. Five Nights at Freddy's?! You discovered Five Nights at Freddy's because of me?! Dude, I'm so happy. The little obscure gaming series known as Five Nights at Freddy's. I can't believe it. No, guys, Freddy party. B and Z do different commands. <laughs> Why? <laughs> what? You can kick it. Uh, I just don't remember what button. Okay. Right. What are you? Um. Uh. <laughs> Obsolete is a very boomer term. Assault is the best game in the series. Um. <laughs> Fred Fastbear. Miyamoto needs to just keep his paws off it. Yeah, because. Miyamoto uses Star Fox as this like weird testing ground for like console gimmickry when in reality you could just stick to the rail shooter stuff and make cool stories with cool characters. That's what I want to see. You don't need to like fuck around with Wii U's like special dildo feature to make a new Star Fox. Just just make a good game. Okay, let's try Z and May the best stony win. So I think I gotta actually shoot at my own thing. There we go. Because I saw the yellow one shooting at his own... ...own goal. Bro, look at that! Video gaming. <laughs> They're going. I like the faces on these lads. They look like Legos. That's exactly what happened to Rayman! Wait, what happened to Rayman? He became obsolete! No! <laughs> Star Fox is just like a Star Wars vehicle section, but for worse. It's the other way around. <laughs> I, I kid. I just... You are allowed to feel. However you want about Star Fox. You've never seen me as angry at a video game as when I was playing Star Fox Zero. Dude, Star Fox Zero sucks balls. Do you not like the Walking Bear video? Yeah. I'm not gonna play it anymore. So now we got red ones that you can use as like distractions. So all their players will lose points. Holy shit, they're like kicking! Whoa! <laughs> the AI of these guys is not the best. <sighs> Starlink's Star Fox DLC slapped. They gave Pigma and Leon some super awesome dialogue for no other reason than to just give them super cool dialogue. Dude, the Star Fox DLC in Starlink was the best Star Fox content we've had since like Star Fox Assault. 
the characters were spot on and I was fucking creaming when they were talking to each other. Oh my god, and the music remixes. If nothing else came from that game, the awesome music remixes did. The Wii U gamepad is nice to hold because of the way they sculpted the back. It's not nice to hold because it's so heavy, it hurts my hands. That's why I could never play Wii U games that long, because it hurts my hands. Is the black one like a good one, like a super ball? Oh, it's a bomb! Okay, so you can actually like attack other players, I see. Yay! Got him! This minigame is fun. I like this one. There we go. Gamepad is actually comfortable hold. Your hands are too small and arms too weak for the Wii U game back. Yeah, same, it's too heavy. The 3DS is too heavy. I can't hold the 3DS up for long because it's too heavy for me. Uh, not the original 3DS, the, the big, chunky latest one. Like 3DS XLI, extra deluxe, come whatever. When the Wii came out, Ubisoft were like, yo, let's use our franchise that we made amazing story games with to make a completely different style of party game just to be relevant with the new technology. Yeah, that's what you were referring to. Yeah, that's... yeah. Yep. I hope the training room doesn't have, like, items in it. You know what game I should play? Kingdom Hearts. You just... but I actually do want to stream the original Kingdom Hearts, because I did play it as a kid. Whew. You used to used to draw Star Fox characters at all, although your take on Pigman is almost unrecognizable. You upped the creepiness factor too much. <laughs> Animal Crossing had a party game on Wii U. Oh yeah, and everyone apparently hated it because they wanted the real Animal Crossing game. <laughs> Separate team starts playing. Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2 are both supposedly pretty good action RPGs, and the story doesn't go completely off the rails in them yet. This Woomba magic not need Glomb next time. Bear chains for free. You don't know if you're swall or if I'm still weak. You personally think the 3DS XLs and the gamepad aren't heavy. Yeah, I don't know what's up. I guess I just have naturally weak arms. It could be possible. Did I get a weeaboo of Kingdom Hearts when I was a small? I'm sorry, uh, cannot compute that sentence, please repeat. Kingdom Hearts 2 plants the seeds that are followed up on Birth by Sleep. Pretty sure people hated it because it was a toy to life game. Oh, okay. I gonna understand that a little bit more because you gotta blow a lot of money if you wanna enjoy toy to life games. By that point, you can't get off of Nomura's wild ride. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nice. Trying to think if there were other places that I missed. Maybe not. Can the postman actually like show me? Okay, I got all the notes, I got the powers, the jinjos, but I'm still missing a couple of uh, jiggies and like the honeycomb items. There was a place I haven't been to yet. I think it was the door at the top. Spe 
speaking of that, remember when Skylanders was a thing? Neither me, neither do I, yeah. It was uh, a time. I'm glad I didn't get into it in the end. I remember being a bit excited. There was a cool trailer, trailer I saw and I was like, yo, this looks cool. But I didn't end up buying it, so I'm glad I didn't. I saved a lot of money that way. Really, Kingdom Hearts 2 is a genuinely great action game. Yeah, I know. I, I tried playing it multiple times, but I never got past the intro. But when I do stream Kingdom Hearts 1, things are gonna be different. Yeah, this place is new. Warning! Trespassers in the quicksand air are liable to be eaten! You've probably told this story before, but you actually studied the lore of Kingdom Hearts a few years back. It was a cry of help, help that predated the release of Kingdom Hearts 3. All right, saved you from that hell of being lore deprived. You hate Kingdom Hearts now. <laughs> Banjo Totoyos. Now that Skylanders emulators are real, you might, might as well give it a shot. Are they able to just emulate all of the characters? Yeah, maybe. Why not? Sounds cool. I guess I can't do that yet. Or I do need to find a combination. There's a hole. Oh, secret area. I hate to scream the cats do when they die. It's just like ah! Kingdom Hearts 2 intro is very very divisive. Yeah. That's why I never got past it. Only a stone can understand what another stone speaks. Oh, I bet there's a stony that tries to, like, help us. Also, this stone... Can't break that. Maybe I can talk to the stone in the middle. Yeah, maybe I need to come back here as a stony. By the way, this conversation happened days ago, but I wishlisted Digimon Cyber Sleuth Saga on Steam to keep an eye on it. If you're genuinely curious about the modern Digimon game and it goes on a good sale, it could be worth picking up. Yeah, I am actually interested in that, that specific game because it looks cool. There's the boots. Let's take those first. Uh. May I tell you something about this game that's a recurring thing? Sure, go ahead. Bond just thick ass. Bond just jump off, please. Bond just please. Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 
<laughs> you still have no idea where the hell all the Kingdom Hearts fans, Kingdom Hearts fans are hiding. There's apparently like a shit ton of them because Sora was the most popular pick for Smash. But like you have never even engaged with a single one of them. They are very different. They are a very different breed of people that I don't think you would interact with in any of your circles. Cypress Leuth is really good. It's just got a terrible translation and it's border on visual novel. Thanks to the original hardware limitations. It's also somewhat grindy. But you like it. Yeah. I wanna check it out. Go check it out! The Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts fans are everywhere. They're just dormant where there's no new Kingdom Hearts games. Guys. Kingdom Hearts fans are... Among us. You were surprised when Kingdom Hearts 3 came out and suddenly 80% of your friends said they've been waiting for it since Kingdom Hearts 2. They activated from their slumber. <laughs> oh. uh, there are jiggies that you won't be able to collect until you get a specific new power in a later world. Uh, that's fine, that's fine. That saves time and headache. <sighs> Where do I turn into the stone boy? There are three distinct types of Kingdom Hearts fans. The lore buffs. <laughs> uh, the gameplay elitists. And the people who actually enjoy the games. <laughs> I can't believe that. Hey, can I watch? What do you want to watch? The Kingdom Hearts speedrunning circles are very active in your land. Here we go, let's go back. The stream! Yeah sure, watch ahead, I'm not stopping you. Except I am. Jade Snake Grove. Uh, pa pa pa. Prison compound, what the fuck? Maybe that's the place. I enjoy the games. Hell yeah. Yo! <laughs> Heavy stony drowning. <laughs> Don't dance at my sadness. <laughs> Dancing on your grave. Oh no, I can't get up as the little stony. Oh, I can. Can you talk to me, big boulder? Hmm, this is funny. Kingdom Hearts 3 seems to like an actually bad game. Hang on. Uh, but you unironically vibe to the Hikaru Utada slash Skrillex collab theme song. I don't think I've heard that. This is how I run when I'm heading towards the sauna. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts 3 had a lot of Disney stuff and no Final Fantasy. I've heard that's a thing in the series, that the Final Fantasy stuff just like disappears after the first game. I wonder why. Actually, I don't wonder why. I know why, because Square Enix... ...balls. The noise Red Cat made when he died in Metopia. <laughs> It just disappeared in Kingdom Hearts 3. Oh, okay, so it was presenting like the 2 also. 
Aren't you supposed to head dive into snow after a sauna? Yes. Some people do that. To free the trapped one, a star must appear before the sun rises. Another star appears, followed by two moons. Does that help? I think so. Star, sun, star, moon, moon. Star. Sun. Star. Moon. Moon. Hey! People kind of hated Kingdom Hearts 3 at launch because of the story and lack of challenge. But Remind fixed that. <gasps> That's the rat! Hello, my little rabbit friend. Me, Dilberta, was out looking for gold when the boulder fell down and wrapped me in here. I suppose you expect us to move it? If you wouldn't mind. Oh, a mole. Oh, man. Do you do that? I, I haven't done the snow thing after a sauna in years. Mainly because... I have neighbors, and I wouldn't want to run around naked in the snow when my neighbors are out. <laughs> Check your eyes. <laughs> Why am I talking about Kingdom Hearts? I don't want this! Watching behind Skog. Dude, Skogging. How do you mow this then? Is this one of those... I need uh, a power from another world to do this kind of deal, D things? I'm asking you guys, is this something I can't do yet? Or do I need to come back as a big... It's for a new move, okay. So, we will return some other time then. Up! Driving into the snow from a sauna is something you do more so at cabin, etc. Our sauna is attached to our bathroom and this is a house lot. Yeah, you can't really just run from the sauna outside. People would see your willy. <laughs> there is a non-zero chance Balan will be in Kingdom Hearts 4, by the way, and I'm not joking. Have other Square Enix franchises made appearances in Kingdom Hearts? Just like, aside from um, ah, Final Fantasy. Have other Stan Final Fantasy appeared in Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> Choose a destination, soldier! Yo. You wee willy winky. Not in three. Oh, I can go in there as the mini man. Okay, let me do that. There was also a mini door somewhere else, but I don't remember where. Nomura isn't ill with Balan though. I thought he only make the franchises he does stuff for a PL in Kingdom Hearts. Wait, oh yeah, I get I get it. By that logic, Gex should appear in Kingdom Hearts 4, dude, imagine. Several have actually, and the uh, way the story is going seems to imply the next game will be more focused on the Squeer crossover than ever. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. You <laughs> wait, the image just at the ready. I have a bunch of old memes on my desktop, and I just dragged it in, just like that. Yeah, booty. <laughs> oh my god, Sonic. The legendary Shrek pasta. New beatbox dropped? What do you mean? 
You gotta ask your bro if you can take over his island. He bought the... hang on. He bought the game originally, didn't let you transform the island whatsoever. Oh yeah, if they don't even play, then yeah. You seeing this shit? <laughs> yeah, put the boat behind the skog. <laughs> oh shit. Kingdom Farts! Hey! 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 Let me take a look because I think there was another hole somewhere, but I don't remember where. Little uh, hole for me. This hole! It was made for me! You sent me something on Discord? It's the horror, 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 horror guy! What the fuck? Guys, listen to this. Let me mute Banjo for a moment. You need to see the video. The video is like half of the fun. This is amazing. You need to see this. Let me download it real quick. Holy fuck. I can't believe it. The man is back. Better than ever. I love this man. Whore, whore, ho, whore, 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 ho, whore, ho, whore. You said that in the Discord already? Ah, oh, shit, I didn't see that. I've seen the meme already. Uh -huh. You really think beatboxing, mouth music, and acapella are all super cool things? Yes. Certified hood classic. I love the headbang. I'm sure there was a little gamer hole for me somewhere around here. He's super stylish too, yeah. That fro is sick. <laughs> he shakes his face on the cover like a maniac. Dude, it's part of the uh, uh, beatbox puppet boom. You know, can't beatbox without the shake. Did I say the W word? What the fuck? W. What do you? What do you mean? What does that? What does that stand for? Did you say the? Does Dunglescock walk like that? <laughs> yeah, he does! <gasps> Guys, imagine if Dunglescock walked, he would walk like this. Can we talk about why FNAF lore is better than Kingdom Hearts lore? <laughs> Unironically, it is. I don't think there was a hole. I'm misremembering. Let me go to the beginning and I think I'm actually gonna call it a day because we're out of time. Gotta return to this world later. <laughs> oh no, here comes another pep essay. I love that people have already grown accustomed to that and like know it's gonna happen. You left him out in the cold, how could you know? It's snowing on Dungel! Okay, see ya dude, don't worry, we are about to end, we are about to end here soon anyway, so... You ain't gonna miss anything. What do I think of MatPat's new FNAF theory? I didn't watch it because MatPat sucks. Let me turn back and then I'm gonna call it a day. For real though, how do you add those effects? You put an emote and after that you put one of the BTTV emote effects. They are just listed as emotes in the PTTV emote thing, so just put the emotes after each other and voila.
Jungle Skog in ice. That's probably my favorite, like seriously. Jungle Skog in ice. It's so good. <laughs> All YouTubers we watch are garbage. Garbage always. That's a very doomer take. Dude, YouTube sucks, bro. Yeah, it does. Everything sucks. But at the same time, it doesn't. Alright. Let's hope my save state works. I'm gonna save here. If it doesn't, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> All YouTubers sucks, including us. Yes. Alright, I think we're done with this. Oh, just like that. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>